see us live on Facebook. Hey everyone. There's YouTube. Hey, hey. Rachel here with Rachel's Unique Crafts. How is everyone? Miss Susan, Miss Mail, Miss Judith. Uh, let's see. Let me try to get this thing off of here. It's hard for me to see like two or three comments in my little space because it put another little block down there. Okay. I may just have to scroll a little bit. It made my block smaller. Okay. We're not going to worry with that. So, happy Tuesday, y'all. Hey, my sweet friend, Miss Monique. I saw you earlier today. How are you? Okay. Let me clean our table off because... As sure as I don't have my keyboard, something will go wrong and I'll need it. And then it's all over on the other side. So <clears throat> this can be a short or a long live. So there's Miss Nancy. We missed you Friday night. So what I've got here, let me show y'all, is a bunch of stuff. A bunch of stuff. And I've already got Friday nights stuffed together. I'm on the ball. Let me tell y'all. And it's going to be a fall project. Hi, Miss Laura. How are you? So, <clears throat> I've done these, I don't know, probably six, seven years ago. But this lampshade, when I bought it, had the little tassels on it. But I took and put some little flowers. Let me see if I can get y'all down where y'all can see see it better. So I just added some flowers to it. And that's not going to be for everybody, but I think it's pretty. I, I like the country look, but I like a little frilly. So a little Victorian, a little bit of shabby. So with this one, I have to take the light bulb off to get it off. So we'll just move this up a little bit. Um, I added flowers and I added a little bit of this little fringe on it. So I just like to doll up some little, um, there's my friend Diane, my sweet mama. There's Miss Susan again. Thanks everyone. My niece turned 21. Had to go out and have a drink with her. Oh, awesome Miss Nancy. Hi Miss Bridget. So, anyway, that's some lampshades. And I've done some others, but that was just a couple of the easy small ones that I could get to. So, um... I have found flowers like on Etsy and then I have made some flowers so you can make little rosette flowers or petal flowers really really easy and y'all I still got this I went to the doctor yesterday got another shot got some different antibiotics and I'm doing a little better. I sound better. So hopefully, I was tired of staying up all night, coughing all night. So anyway, you can make these little um, rosettes really, really easy. And then you can add some totally dazzled um, gems in there to the center of them. So we're going to go over this and um, I have a link in the YouTube. Um, description for Totally Dazzled. 
Y'all, for years I bought off of eBay my gems, and I can promise you, Totally Dazzled is so much cheaper and so much prettier. They've got this rose gold that is my favorite. So anyway, we've got some of those. Let me get y'all back to the table. Hi, Tamara. How are you? Susan, you look lovely. Oh, thank you, Miss Susan. Uh-oh. <laughs> Y'all on YouTube, it just went blank. <laughs> it went blank. Wow. And Margaret. Jennifer. You love Totally Dazzled? They are. They're wonderful. Get over here. Good. I was thinking about you. Um, last week, Miss Tamara, I certainly was, and I said I should text you, but life gets busy, and I put it off, and then, <clears throat> okay, so on Amazon, y'all, I got this for like $3.99, and this one was $4.99, and I think it was 50% off, it was at the at-home store. So, on Amazon, let me show y'all, there's links to all, I went, I did good. Last night I got on here and I went searching. I miss you too, Tamara. I do. Um, I went on Amazon and got all my links. So, in you, on YouTube, hi, Miss Linda. Um, if y'all want to click on the links, you can. Um, for these little concoctions, <laughs> these little adapters. This is a lamp and it's for, it's got a cork in it. So you can buy these bottles, the clear bottles at Hobby Lobby. Um, you can get wine bottles, you can get, this was actually, um, and it needs to be washed. A bottle to feed hummingbirds with it was upside down and it had a, a hanger well the hanger broke so I saved the bottle so it's kind of a red tinnish color to it um, you can find all kind of bottles everywhere different shapes different sizes and this little concaption thingy <laughs> It's a light socket, so it'll go down as a cork. It's got a cork on it, and it does have to be plugged in first to actually work. So, you can put it on any kind of bottle. This is the Hobby Lobby bottle that you want. And all you have to do, and you can get this if you don't have one. If you have a um, lampshade that needs to sit on the top. It's a long screw. Um, that has a top like that. Um, I don't think I have one, yes I do. So if it's got the little bars like this, this would go just like that. And then it would fit over your light bulb. So I found these. I thought they were so cute. Hi Miss Sherry, how are you? and make the lamp. That's right, Miss Nancy. It would. I bet you get more giggles. <laughs> Where did you get the light? Are you talking about this fiction? 
back. This is on Amazon, and the link is in the in the description. So, um, also, I got to show you all some more little adapters that I found. So, if you don't want a big lamp, you can decorate the shade. Because we got all kind of stuff over here. Um, you might not see it right. You can't tell when it comes on like that. But these are on Amazon. And they're a little hard plastic. These are little fairy lights. And they come in white or they come in colored. But y'all, I'm a sucker for anything with lights, fairy lights. Y'all can tell my outside. Um, the red one would be pretty too. Red and green for Christmas. Um, there's my sweet sister. I'm breaking up. Oh my goodness. Y'all let me know if it's still breaking up. That ain't gonna work. Thank you, Miss Rebecca. Appreciate the sprinkles. All the love. So I love this idea already. I know, I love, um, yes, what is the the light socket. Um, it's the light socket on the with a little cork on the end. And when it comes, it let's see. It's just a. It's a. You get like three different um, size corks. So like if you had a bigger bottle. That one would fit in there too, but I think this one would too. See, that one would stick up a little taller. Um, you get three different corks, and you just, it's got a little long um, screw. Put it in there, screw it just a little bit, and then you put this little washer there on the end and screw it in there till it's tight. I just thought I've had these for months and just hadn't got everything together to, to do this. There's my sweet Aunt Glenda. Thank you, Miss Laura. It's time for a new dessert video <laughs> are you talking like dessert to eat or are you talking about um dessert like fake make dessert <laughs> Let's see. I'm looking for something long so we could kind of push that down in there but um let's see we got a skewer over here Is it still breaking up, y'all? <clears throat> I know it's very cloudy. This little candle, I don't know if you can tell, it's flickering a little bit. Yes, to eat. <laughs> We'll have to um, see what we can come up with this season and um, get that taken care of. 
All right. Um, if you don't want the candle on top, they have them with just the little cork looking um, lights without the little candle on top. It's going to get tangled here. So, eat while we fake bake. <laughs> There's Miss Stone. Hi, Miss Stone. So, and if y'all wanted colored lights, they do have them in colored. We're making bottle lights and bottle lamps. And I will tell you <coughs> what I would do is I like the lamps and the lights with the candles. So if I wanted to do my lamp and I wanted lights in the bottom of it also, um, no, it quit. Okay, thank you, Miss Margaret. Um, here's what I would do I would just let this fall in the back. Where the cord is, and I would probably do this on a colored bottle, but to show y'all, this way you could have your lights on the bottom, and you could have the lamp, and it's a full functioning lamp. So that's the way I would probably do it. And I would do that so that it, you couldn't see it. Because we're not done. Um, you can get these and I forgot to get the this is one I forgot to get the um, link to this one hi Mary Ann how are you cool thank you I haven't seen the ones with candles on top only cork well we have them with the candles um, also, you can, this is a cork, this is a smaller bottle, it's going to need one of them other corks. So these are on Amazon also, and they, these are tapper candles, and they have, um, a timer on them, so when you turn them on, I think they stay on four hours if I'm not mistaken, and then they automatically go off. But how cute. So, that's an option. And I'm just showing y'all this just because I love it. We're fixing to decorate a, a lampshade, y'all. But while I was on vacation last week, I went to the antique market. And y'all look how cute. Now, this came from Amazon, and it's got a silicone... Um, candle looking like a little um, flame night light bulb and so I've got the link to that one and you can just get little light bulbs if you just want the little light bulbs and change them out but 
um, all these candles I got off of Amazon. And all the batteries are dead, of course, because last Christmas I used them a lot. Let's get that advertisement off of there. So anyway, this is um, this is on one of my videos also. Hey, Carol. Oh, well, thank you. Hi, oh, welcome. We're so glad you're here. I'm live every Tuesday night and Friday night. I was tied up in a meeting. Oh, you're not very late, Miss Joan. Um, this is a sock, and I just cut it off. I, it's um, coffee stained. Put a little, few little flowers on there, and a totally dazzled um, gem. And. Of course, I use my doilies. These were five dollars the spindle, and y'all, I buy these every time I go up there. I buy them, but that's how I do my spindles. So, and y'all, totally dazzled. They have sales on their gems all the time. This was one of the pillar candles from Amazon, and I took and just mod podged and put glitter on the bottom, put some um, beads around. And of course, a little gem from Totally Dazzled. We getting totally dazzled today. So you can also take your tall candle and put up there. So we're just all about some lights tonight. That's what we're doing. But um, let's see. We gotta um. Work on a lampshade. This trim came from Hobby Lobby and it's over in the section where um, the upholstery material is. And so this lampshade was $4.99 and I think it was 50% off at the at home store. Y'all, when I went to Hasbro one day, I was supposed to be meeting my younger son and I called him. He said, uh, Where are you at? And I said, At, at home. <laughs> he was kind of puzzled because I said, At home. But I was at the at home store. He said, well, I was wondering how I was going to meet you. And he knew I was supposed to be down there. So, just going to use some hot glue. And if y'all are hunting the um, the light bulbs, you know, I've made the chandeliers with the remote control light bulbs. They're battery operated. You can turn them on for 30 minutes or just on or whatever. Those are on Amazon also. Just telling y'all some neat little stuff that I have found. At different times and of course it all has to do with the light bulbs I love light crafts I said I was gonna do a, a double tier chandelier I have not got around to it So, and they have all kind of little trim that you can use. I think 
this might have cost like five dollars and something. But you don't have to get this kind. They have this is $4.99 and it goes 50% off every other week. So that would be um $2.50 and it's got two yards on it. So they have different trims that you can get and use. Here's just some lace. Getting warm with all the light. <laughs> yes. Hey, Mr. Danny, how are you? We're making um bottle lamps and lights. I saw your mom today. You're sitting in the camper. Wow. Yeah, she said y'all were uh, boat riding and camping and she didn't want to go. She had a little time with that camera, but she did great. She did so good today. Sweet, sweet lady. Miss um, Helen from Georgia. Got to see her today. I need to send her a little happy. Okay, let's put this a few little strings here. And we'll end this one right here. So, that's how easy it is to transform. I don't have enough to go around the top with this one. So, <clears throat> Uh, Miss Monique is so sweet. She does. She she shares for me every time. She'll get on Facebook and she'll get on YouTube. She's definitely a gem. That one doesn't have a wide enough. See how it's got this um, red color on the top? <clears throat> and on this one, I, I sit here and cut. It's got a little um, string there at the bottom. And all you have to do is, just between each little tassel, just kind of cut it right there. And some of them will come on out. It's probably a, a magic little string that would make it come loose. But I didn't have the patience to try to sit there and try to find it. So. Mr. Danny, I hope y'all have a fun trip. Everybody needs a, a good getaway every once in a while. Enjoy a little bit of life and a little bit of rest and fun. We had a little bit of that 
last weekend. We took off to Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. So we went through Georgia. The, the little corner of it anyway. There's Miss Shantae. We we are Miss Shantae, we're making all kind of lights, lighted bottles and lamps and we're just trying to shed some light on the situation. <coughs> Almost cut enough strings in between these tassels. There we go. I kind of separate them. Just showing them different, different little ways to change up. So if you go to yard sales or um, flea markets, anything, you find lampshades. You can always change them up. So don't look at them as, you know, whatever state they're in. That's the, the state they have to stay in. That way. So, you can still have the bottle with the lights, we'll just have to bring this up a little bit more. And then we would put our light bulb in. So you can get different colors. This one came from um, Hobby Lobby. And let's see. You can get the little rolls of lace. It's little florets. Florets. You can make you some. You can add. If you make the little petal flowers yourself, and I will tell y'all what I did on these. I have a pattern somewhere because I used to make big brooches. I don't know where my pattern is, but um, I made it myself. You just make little petals, a circle with little petals. You just make different sizes, and I would light a match, and I would uh, singe the edges to make them turn up. So, you can add, and for the ones that came late, so, now I bought this lampshade like this, except I added the flowers, and this is another little one that I made, and this is, like I said, six, seven years ago, probably, I made those. So, you can make them any old way. And lamps, you can add beads, add glitter, add um, little gems. This is actually yarn that I used on one of those lamps. And see how it's got the little fringe on there? So, you can even add it up here for another layer of texture. Let's see where the back of this is. I guess it's not going to matter. But, and I like earth tones. You can do any colors to match a room. Um, and like this little lampshade, I'm going to... 
at this boa. This boa come from Etsy, and it's curled on the end, and they call it a curly boa. I love that color. It's probably would be called a dusty rose. I don't know that I would have anywhere in my house to it would match, but it's pretty. So, let's just add, and this, usually, I would sew these, but, listen, I was in a hurry, so I just added a little hot glue. It's going to stick. It's going to stay. And then I cut three little beads off of here and put it in the middle. That is, it doesn't have to be complicated. But, just giving y'all some ideas of what you can, what you can do. And I like the brown, but I think I want to just keep it with some neutrals that's light neutrals. And I've gotten down to a bare minimum of little flowerets left. But if you can't make them, you can um, order some off of Etsy. She was frustrated this morning. Oh. Yep, she was she was saying that she needed Danny to help her. <laughs> we were headed out three weeks camping trip. Oh, you can have internet now. That's awesome. Yay. So we won't have to miss you. Yes. Miss Jennifer, Victorian style crafts. I love those. I love watching Miss Helen. Miss Wish. Yes. I hope I have that much energy at her age also. My hands were in the dish pan. I hope y'all have fun. So, I think I'm going to just use this one as neutral. Now the, um, let's see, we got more, um, lights. Let's see. So we've got a green one done. We've got this one. We'll just pull this little tab out. And like I said, if y'all want um, colored ones, they got colored ones. I had actually ordered the um, the quartz with just the lights the first time and then I had them for a little while and then I found the ones with the candles 
Like Monique said, she didn't know they had the ones with the little candle on top. going to be all tangled up because somehow they got the wires together. So, that'll be okay. Maybe we need to put this one in the red one. Miss Nancy, I'm excited y'all got got it wired for internet. It's gonna, it's gonna be fun. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna feed this one through down here. Like I said, how pretty would this be on a mantle for Christmas? With the red and the green. Then you can make a lamp. You could use the lamp or you could use the little fairy lights. Thank you, Rebecca. Lock him into the camera. <laughs> Maybe in belly storage. <laughs> Miss Nancy, you are so funny. While we were uh, in the mountains, we passed by this big golf course, and I was like, "Don't you?" I told my husband, I "said Don't you um, want to start golfing?" He's like, "No, it's too hot." And um. I said, why would I want to go out there and hit a ball to go get a ball in the scorching hot? Well, I don't know, but for my wedding reception, we added lights to different lighting and turned out very pretty. Oh, Miss Shantae, that sounds gorgeous. Thank you, Miss Susan. You just love this. No, we don't live in Sweden. <laughs> what state am I in? I am in Mississippi. And I sound really raspy. Because I'm trying to get over a sinus infection and uh, touch a strep throat. come home sick from vacation but I'm getting better I feel better sound I do sound better than I did Friday night so with the different shapes of bottles that you can get love them. I think they're so cute. So on this one I'll probably do just like I'm going to do that one. I'm going to just let this hang off the back and then add and I didn't realize it till right before I came on. This lampshade has got to have the smaller lamp, the smaller lamp um, bulb. So that's what it'll look like. Isn't that cute? But I'm going to put the brown boa on this one. I just love these. I'm 
Let's see if I can kind of, there we go, kind of clamp, clamp it, clamp it down while I put the fuzzies on it. We need a technique to cut off the bottom. Um, Miss Shante, you just triggered, you just triggered a, a, a thought. I bought glass, a glass cutter to cut bottles, to cut the bottom off. It's down on the bottom shelf and I have not opened it from Amazon. <laughs> I gotta go watch Miss um, Helen's live from Tuesday. No, from Friday. Because they took her to eat. And I didn't get to see that one, so I gotta go back and see it. Hi, Miss Angela. What, Miss Su What is it, Miss Susan, you need? <laughs> After you broke one or two, you got the hang of it. Well, that's probably what I will do. I need to practice on some some old. But I mean, I ordered the the oil and everything for it last year, and did not even think about it when I got these out. So I'm glad you said that. y'all that was the perfect amount of fufu of boa to go around i used to call my um brooches fufus i just love the fuzzy you wish you would have had a glass cutter oh my goodness how did you cut it can we take a mess and cause him trouble? Oh no. That lamp, I need to make one. Yes, Miss Susan, you do. Thank you, Miss Judith. Y'all, y'all can put the lampshades on anything. It don't have to be lighted bottles, but I just, when I saw those on, Amazon, I was like, I can't not get none. And then I saw the uh, clear bottles is at um, Hobby Lobby. Um, and like this one was um, used for a, to put hummingbird feeder in. So I was like, let's see. I think this one needs some lights in it, but I would have to do something up top. But I got to find a thing to put a lamp, a little light bulb. Not sure if that one's not big enough. So that's not gonna hold it up. But let's 
So that can be used like that. And the candle is um, a taper candle and it's on a timer. And those are at Amazon also. So I could attach that like that. Let me get that out of the way so y'all can see that one. And that would be too cute. I like this bottle. <clears throat> so my son from time to time likes for me to make something for him. So, of course he would not like the fufu. That wouldn't go over too good with him. But, these other ones he might would would like. Hi Miss Joyce, how are you, Miss Debbie? Good to see y'all. I'm staying with her, she's my baby. That's sweet, Mr. Danny. I know, I gotta go see it, Miss Monique. I'll have to watch from the beginning probably tomorrow. I'm happy to get up at 3 a.m. Oh my goodness. Will you have a good evening to get some rest, Miss Angela? You better sell on eBay. Good night, Miss Angela. You have a great evening. So we're gonna put one of these together. Let's see, let's pull this little tab out. Y'all, I do have a couple of solar crafts I need to get done. I got the stuff. Just had not had the time. So, anywho. Oh, we gotta add a, um, a totally dazzled gem to our lampshade. This one's going to be. There it is. Feed that down in there. Here we go. So today's just Tuesday. What's the plans for the rest of the week? Now I won't throw out my bottles. That's right, Miss Susan. I just, I love anything with lights, and if you've got a dark area in your house, lights just make everything just pretty. That's just all there is to it. Lights just make things pretty. Since this is, um, Clear. We're going to add a totally dazzled gem, a silver one. Right here. It's 
got a few little pearls just to add a little glam. Tell you what, look right here. Let's see. I think I got, yeah, I got one more here. Let's do this. Let's take this one out and put this one. I'll be on a scavenger hunt for some more um, bottles. These are really turning out prettier than I really thought they were. Sent for Grandma to come in here. Fishing Lake tomorrow. Then wash and wax. The camper, we leave Sunday. Oh my goodness! Sounds awesome. Miss Nancy's going to be on her camping again. Well, at least you'll have internet now. I'm excited. Friday night's um, craft is going to be a fall craft. And I did not get the supplies from Dollar Tree. But some of the supplies I have seen at Dollar Tree, and you could get from Dollar Tree, but the ones that I'm using are not from Dollar Tree. So, you just have to be here to see what I'm talking about. Okay, so we could leave this one like this. And get your... Uh, little dowel and you can move your lights around but I think this would look better with the little now um These, this is like 50 in a box. <clears throat> what you can do is, if you don't want to spend a lot on one of these, these are really cheap. You can paint these brown, so you can paint this in any color you wanted. And then you can do it just like that. How cute! So you would need to make it where it fit tight. Put a piece of tape or something. There you go. And these are on Amazon also. So, who all was going to make um, bottle lamps, bottle lights? Yes, ma'am, I'll be here on Friday. And Miss uh, Nancy's going to be here on Friday. <laughs> so, now then, so who's going on a scavenger hunt to hunt for, um, bottles you can either buy you some wine buy you some what rum whiskey Kayla 
<laughs> and Miss Debbie said she will definitely make one. Awesome! If you just want the plain clear ones, they're at um, Hobby Lobby. Now if you go over on YouTube, I got all the links to all the lights, light bulbs that I showed. Um, all that kind of stuff is in the description of that of the video over there. Um, get you some cheap lampshades and get some of this trail from Hobby Lobby and you're set to go. And if you need some gems from um, Totally Dazzled, well, you could even dress up the glass ones and put this on the front. How stinking cute! Let me move this one out of the way. But you can actually take these and just like I did this little candle, I glued that straight to the candle. So you can decorate your candles and all these came from, and y'all look at this. All right, it's got a, a moving wick. It's a plastic moving wick, of course, because it's not real. But these are on a, a timer also. They're, they'll go on and come off at whatever time you set them. Check with restaurants that serve mixed drinks. They will probably gladly give you bottles. That's a great idea, Miss Debbie. And places that do um, um, like wine testing and stuff like that, that they're opening bottles, they would probably give them to you also. Oh, these are cute. Never occurred to me to do this. Awesome, Miss Joan. Miss Monique. You can, Miss Jennifer. You can. You absolutely can. And these. This is a LED light bulb, so it's not hot. And it's been on for a while. So one's coming in late this is an adapter you can get at Amazon and it's a cork lamp adapter so it fits in a just like that and then you get whatever kind of lamp shade you want so but I just thought these were cute they look rustic and they've got a little silicone, I think it's a little warm, but it's a silicone um, light bulb. And you can just add, like this is a sock that was coffee stained. And I just put some little flowers on it and a little totally dazzle gem. And then you got a candle holder. So, y'all will have to make some and show me pictures. And I'm probably going to put, um, one of these. I'm not sure which one yet. Look even got grapes on it. You can make something for your kitchen. This is a holy dazzle. I, I love that rose gold. So, let's see. Y'all, I used to buy these um, gems on eBay until I hooked up with Totally Dazzled. And let me tell you, Totally Dazzled is so much cheaper. And they're much prettier too. So I think I'm going to do that right there. for some lights. Let's see. This is glass and bead um, adhesive. Let me get 
that out of my eyes. Amazon. And no crafting Sweden. <laughs> no, I have the same stuff over here. Uh, going to Eden Hollywood's awesome, Mr. Danny. Have fun. Miss Margaret's got to go to work tomorrow. Will you have a good evening, Miss Margaret? Oh, really, Miss Susan? sure this is going to have to set up for some time. I'm not going to turn it back up to stay because of that. So, y'all, I'll have to show y'all in a picture once it dries. But that's, I've got it on that flat surface. So, that's what that one's going to look like. This one. <coughs> I just I love it on. I like the different colors you give me for Christmas or for anything. Need. If you got a lampshade that's got that um this bar, all you have to have is something like this. It'll hook on your light bulb, and then you'll have a lampshade. So I hope y'all like this, and I hope y'all give it a try. And I'm gonna find something to put this one on. I didn't know it. Until right before I come on, that it's for a little night light. So, I may even add, since that one's got silver, I may add a little um, totally dazzle gem to this one. But see, you could even put the grape and put it in the kitchen. How cool would that be? This is what I'm hunting, my pliers. So, do y'all have um, night lights? You could add your um, own trim to those. Put you some bling bling on them. How many times am I going to take that off tonight, right? So, let's see. I cannot believe that it is already August, y'all. And the schools has already started back. Pieces. I'll have them. Is it totally the I'll have them. Yeah. Back on them. Miss Jennifer, they do. 
they have they all have the pins um i don't know you probably can't oh goodness Y'all, I'm having issues here. <laughs> okay, so they all have the little, the pin on the back. But, I just take the pliers and, and break it off. So, that one's going to be like that. And it's just going to add a little... A little prettiness to it that is sticky and this is just as glass and bead adhesive so hopefully it'll hold it so y'all give this a try y'all have to let me know how it turns out I'll put that glue gun and so we will be here Friday night doing a craft. It's going to be a fall craft. Um, some of the supplies can be bought from the Dollar Tree, um, but probably not all of them. But mine did not come from Dollar Tree, but I have seen some of them. So there's that. But anyway. You can get up here, I see y'all. Thank you, Miss Susan. Oh, one of the guys' name is Hot. Okay. I was thinking they was going to eat. Okay, they must be going to um, Hollywood's camper to eat. Tumbling blocks. What about tumbling blocks, Miss Linda? Thank you, Miss Sherry. I have never even thought about doing this with bottles. <laughs> Well, Miss Monique, you have something new to make now. See, I'm just trying to keep you busy, girlfriend. Just trying to keep you busy. I don't want you to get bored. Miss Linda, what about tumbling box? Lamps out of tumbling blocks, maybe? I think these are so cute. Thank you, Miss Shante. Good night. Have a great rest of the week. I'm going to push that in there, and we're fixing to. We're about done. You made lanterns with and paint sticks. Then with paint sticks. You made lanterns. Oh, okay. Had a moment there. Awesome! Lanterns with paint sticks. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, Miss Monique. Miss Susan, it is hot. It is hot, hot. You're welcome, Miss Nancy. Yes. It is smoldering. I am, I'm ready for cooler weather, I promise y'all. 
and I think that one's empty. Um, on top of having the sinus crud in the summer, summer colds are the worst. So, I will see y'all Friday night. Y'all have a rest of a good week. Remember that I love you all and get to crafting, make something beautiful. And if you make some of these, um, share your pictures with me. I want to ooh and all over them. Because y'all can come up with better ideas than I can. Good night, Miss Debbie. So, I don't work on home all day, but I need more than 12 hours. <laughs> I know, right, Miss Monique? <laughs> right, Jennifer? Yep. Here I come, Amazon, huh? So, I will see y'all Friday night, 7 o'clock Central Standard Time, and what? 2 o'clock for Miss Monique over in the Sweden community. <laughs> I know, it's just one hour. Well, it's an hour and 15 minutes. So, it's, it's not our usual two hour night but um that'll probably be friday night because um i i'm making something a little different than i've made one before so you know it's kind of um figure it out as you go kind of thing so anyway i love y'all Get to crafting, make something beautiful, and I will see y'all Friday night right here, same place, same time. Good night, y'all.